Hello guys, this is Neanderthal Gaming and welcome back to Hearthstone. Uh, today I'll be uploading my first arena run uh, because it has been going very well actually. The reason why I'm uploading this one is because it is the so far the best arena run I've ever had. Uh, and uh, spoilers, it doesn't finish this episode. We go on to episode 2 for sure. But um, I didn't record narration over the first, I think, 3 or 4, I think it was 4 games. Um, simply because I don't record uh, over all of it, ever. Um, I don't record all of my all, all of my runs, is what I should say. Um, because most of them are terrible. The, the best I've done, embarrassingly, is uh, five. Five wins, yeah. So five and three is my best. Uh, but this one, this one's a little different. Um, so, you know, I chose Paladin, as you saw there, I had one Legendary, and I could've chose Mimiron's head, but I figured I didn't have enough mechs to do that. Um, so I chose uh, Major Domo Executus, and he actually comes in handy two times uh, in this uh, in these games. And so there he is. Uh, I got a couple of pretty good cards, a lot of uh, shielded mini bots, um, and those came in handy quite a bit also. Uh, and so the first game here, you know, just a basic. Um, he he had a pretty good play there with the uh, with the uh, Glaive Zuka. I uh, still so got rid of the Raptor, he played the Spider Tank, which was even better. Um, I didn't really want Major Domo in my hand at this time, but yeah. Also, the Stormwind Champion really, really is a good arena card in my mind because, uh, yeah, it just is really good. It saved me quite a few times. Um, that Trog ended up being really annoying. But yeah, I've already bursted him down to 15 health left, which is really good. Uh, I was basically looking for uh, just a way to get Major Domo out and kill him with fireballs. But he fl he flooded the board with minions, and so I had to get rid of that. I had to do a uh, not-so-great trade there. He made a really good play with the uh, the Crazed Alchemist there. I was impressed. Um, killed that. The bomber took the bot out. Eventually. <laughs> There's the core hound. I wasn't sure what to do with this one, so I just uh, blessing of wisdom to my guy and, and killed the core hound so I could draw one more card. And then I should have played the uh, questing adventurer before I played all those. I, I don't know what I was thinking there, but that's okay. Uh, it didn't matter in the end. Because he's already down to 10. And that, that was very unlucky of me. Um, but then, yeah, I pulled Major Domo out just as a risk. I know he had to either kill that or hit me in the face and I could kill him, so he had to kill that. And I knew he didn't have enough to kill it, but he did because of the abusive sergeant. And then I had to get really lucky here. I had to have killed the Kodo, otherwise I would have lost, I'm pretty sure. Uh, actually, no, I would have been really close. But then I got the heal bot, and then I killed that, and then I got unlucky again and hit the spider instead of hitting him. Uh, but then he didn't have enough damage, and... I got it taken care of, so a really lucky first game. Uh, so yeah, that set the tone for the rest of the episode, that's for sure. Uh, lots of mini-bots, I like that hand, two twos and a two threes, plus the coin is perfect, and then I drew my third mini-bot. Uh, so yeah, that's, I think I have three or four, I can't remember if I have four. Um, but yeah, really good early game. Uh, and I like using the questing adventure later because uh, you can get it buffed up pretty pretty well. Uh, I played the Drake there because I had lots of cards in my hand. Um, and yeah, I was trying to avoid a uh, inner fire there. So I tried to do as much damage to that uh, Amogashim as I could. Oh wait, not inner fire. Sorry, that was a different game. I don't know what I was trying to avoid there. <laughs> there, was a different, there was a different game where I played against the priest that had uh, Amogashim. That's okay. Um, what did I go for here? That's right. Yeah, I went just flood the board. I didn't want to have just a 3-3 because he would just die to the Reaper. And so I just went with those guys. And then, boom, Stormwind Champion pulls through, does awesome. Uh, that Cult Master was really good. Uh, the Imp took out my Stormwind Champion. And there goes my mini bots and a Golem. That was a good turn for him. Uh, but I got the Questing Adventure up uh, behind my Sludge Belcher, which is great. And all of a sudden he pulls out Hell Scream, and I was like, oh great, now I'm screwed, right? No, because I got that Questing Adventure up the turn before, uh, I could safely take out uh, Hell Scream. And now I have one minion on the board, and then he floods it again. <laughs> but 
I had, what did I do? Yeah, I did Sunwalker here, and then give it attack. Give it tons of attack, so uh, all his minions that would attack it would die. He plays the dragon, and the warrior, and battle rages, and concedes for some reason. <laughs> Not quite sure why, but uh, he did, yeah. So, 2-0, I was like, awesome, this is, this is good. Uh, and uh, my, best, my best start ever was 3-0, and that was on that 5-3 series. So I was doing, I was pretty happy. I was like, awesome, maybe we can get another, something like this going again. Uh, mini bots. I didn't want to play the mini bots because I had three mana, and the Razor Fen would have been a better choice. And then I have the Tall Strider in. Um, I didn't have very many other options other than the Tall Strider, and so I kind of put it as an anti, anti Yeti because that's what it is. It's a five four for four, so it's it's exactly a foil of a Yeti. Um, it just dies a little bit easier, but I mean, it kills Yetis pretty well. Uh, flooded the board with bots here again. This guy ran a Dragon Paladin, which is pretty, pretty good. Uh, he ended up getting lots of the good cards. Again, Stormwind Champion, amazing in this matchup. And then I got a really lucky uh, Flame Imp from the Dragon, which is nice. Uh, that heal, that, uh, whatever, the heal 6 actually helped me a lot in this game because I got to heal my Stormwind. Uh, I think I, oh yeah, I, I wanted to kill the, um... And the crazed alchemist last so I, in case he got a mean secret and so i did that kodo last he got the secret and i had the full board and he conceded <laughs> three no i was like all right this is as great as i've ever done uh this game was really really funny actually <laughs> i think it was this game yeah it was, just, it was the priest game uh so i got a molten giant in here too uh that actually came into play in one of the next games more mini bot action let's see this guy was a pretty slow player uh, so he, he's kind of running like a mech mage type of deal he's got a lot of mechs and he's I'm not mech mage sorry mech priest duh um, oh yeah and I couldn't not consecrate there it was just too good clear his board that was all nice and then this guy comes out 7-7 seven, seven. Very scary. And then the Cult Masters. Oh man, the Cult Masters. Or not the Cult Masters. Um, Dark Cultists. This guy had, I think, three Dark Cultists. And I don't think I killed any of them. I do not think I killed a single one. I think he killed all of them. Because I hate. Oh, they're so good though. Dark Cultists. Um, I did not want the cultist to boost the light spawn because that would be devastating and so I had to get rid of the light spawn as fast as possible. There's his second dark cultist. Uh, not one has died yet so I just played a bunch of taunts and uh, killed the trog. I didn't have very many spells in this deck. I had lots of heals. Uh, Demolisher there. I had to get rid of that. Didn't want it popping my shield. Uh, what did I do here? Oh, I did play that. Okay. And then I, yeah, and I put the 2 2. Okay. And then, so I think he actually kills one of his own Dark Cultists here. Uh, but I do a lot of damage to his face. That was nice. I didn't want to boost that, boost that Ravenholt too much uh, with health. And it, he did, obviously, with the Cultist, but that's okay. There's his fourth? Third or fourth. I can't remember what it was. Um, but he's only at 12 health. So I was like, okay, this, this is looking good. Um, I definitely wanted to kill the shield Masta, and then I had to take a risk. I did have eye for an eye, which was really, really nice, because he did the stupidest thing I've ever seen, and he hit first with the, with the Ravenhold Assassin. And if you don't know what eye for an eye does, it does seven. If he does seven to me, it does seven to him, and I said thank you very much. <laughs> and then, uh, yeah, he didn't have anything that could stop Major Domo, and right to the face another great win all right guys so I am live now no more commentating no more speeding up so uh, this is the best arena start I've ever had um, my best arena key is only five wins uh, and that one I went I think I started three and oh and then I lost two one one two and then lost the last one something like that but uh, yeah this is the best start I've ever had in an arena and so I decided to put it on YouTube because uh, yeah I said I would <laughs> And so we're just going to try to keep the luck going here. I've never had more than five wins, like I said, so this would be good. I'm not sure at what point you get four rewards. Maybe it's six, maybe it's eight or something, because I know you can only get 12 wins in the arena. 
and I know the max rewards is five. And so I'm not sure where it changes between three and five. I'm not sure where it's four. You asked for it. I will fight Terrible hand. And uh, man, some of those, some of those games were really close. <laughs> and some of them came down to just stupid gimmicky cards like that eye for an eye one. Okay, at least we got the Crusader. Um, hmm. Crusader is terrible against Mage, though. <laughs> at least we got one of our. How many do we have? Three or four shielded mini bots. These cards are awesome. Great, great two drop. Super annoying <laughs> to deal with. That's for sure. This is a good card to deal with that. Actually, no, it's not. Crap, because he has that. <laughs> Dang it. Oh, uh, man, that makes me sad. Okay, well, I guess we got to start doing it. Please don't be smart. Please don't be smart. No, don't don't eyeball that. No, I know. I see you eyeballing it. Yeah, yes, yes. Thank you. Thank you. You're not gonna kill one of them. Um, yeah. No, I can't. What am I talking about? I was thinking I was a mage for a second. Um, definitely do that. And definitely start whittling. Let's see. We'll probably go ping, hit, hit, and still have that guy with one health, but that's okay. Hmm. Or he'll do that and freeze me. That's fine. Um. All right. That means he's probably got duplicate, which is fine with me. Um. Does a okay. yeah? Does a mirror entity copy those things? I'm not sure. Let's see if he gets one of these. It is mirror entity. Okay, if they do not get the guys. That's fine though. We can kill this. That means he has to spend half his mana killing that, probably. Or he has another way to deal. Let's find out. Oh, come on. There you go. Now you only got two mana. Are you going to do anything? No? Okay. Oh, how many of those do you have? Alright, this would only be a 4-5. I don't really want that. But, there's nothing else I can really play. I think I'm gonna do that and then that. And then kill this guy. Because I don't think he can kill this in this turn unless he fire fireballs it, which would be okay with me. I need some card draw. Dang it. Well, if you if you polymorph a Twilight Drake, that is a good use of a polymorph in my book, because uh, now he can't use it on some of my other good guys. All right, let's. I don't really want to consecrate. I'm not going to. I don't have to. I can just that and this, and then I'll probably hit you. Yes. And the next turn we got that. If we keep as many as I think we could, which is only one. <laughs> I think he's gonna live, and that's it. Yeah, here comes the pay. Oh! Okay, yeah. It looked like he was aiming here for a second. That's okay. That's okay, that's okay. Uh, ooh. Okay. Uh, yeah, we're playing that instead of the champion. Ooh, we did the damage. This game's not turned out so well. Of course, the game I'm actually narrating, uh, I, I'm gonna lose. <laughs> Maybe. We're not out of it yet. I mean, I've only gotten six health down. Plus, I have board control. Kinda. Yeah, I do. Well, he can kill my Yeti this turn. And get whatever comes out of that. 
what to do. They are bent to do. my command. That's a wait. Oh, okay, I thought he it looked like he was aiming at that. I'm like, yeah, that's a good idea if you have a weapon, but you're a mage. Oh, come on. Seriously. Okay. Crap. Uh well we can do this now, I guess. Yeah. Behold looks... the might of the battle. The battle. That's like the best card for it to drop for a mage. Next turn, I don't really want to play that yet because, oh, come on, because uh, it will only do six, and so I'll probably play this, and one of these, unless I get something else. If I get Major Domo, I'll probably also not play that. Double Consecration is what I have. Okay, well, this is, this is okay. Got a big taunt up. Big attack, I guess. It's better because uh, he has nothing on the board. Let's see what he gets. See what he's got for nine mana. That's pretty good. Not good enough though. Oh, I think good. He took that. That was smart. Hmm. You see, I shouldn't consecrate that now because there's no point. Uh, I'll let him run it into the 6-5 and then I'll consecrate next turn. So let's just Fair hit him well. in the face. And I guess, do we heal ourselves? Hmm. I think we keep that in case we uh, direly need it when we transform into Ragnaros eventually. I guess I could have done that and healed for seven. Yeah, that would probably have been a, a good idea. Dang it. Uh, should have done that. Uh, well, now we're in trouble. <laughs> oh, no. That's not good enough. Crap. Okay. Now we can play this. That was some big misplays there. By me. Just like that questing adventure misplay. Whoops. Sorry if you hear a little crinkling noise. I have a cough drop in my mouth. <laughs> Come on. I wish your opponents could see these cannonballs flying at them. Just to like let them know to hurry up. Oh. Well, consecration is good against that. As long as he hits something. And not my face. Double consecration works, I guess. But uh, I, I guess I could just pop the bubble with my little guy. Is that a mech? Oh, good, it's not a mech. Okay, good. Oh. Wow. Okay. Um... That works. Oh, I wish I could have taken. Why couldn't I have taken one more damage? I could have double consecrated and played the molten giant. Oh well. Uh, we're gonna the go battle. like that. Like that. Say hello. Ooh. And we go you. And we. And uh, let's him in the face because I'm sensing a hit and a ping so there'd be no point damaging him. That works all right. Come on. Don't fireball it. What are you doing? You gonna hit it now? Yeah. That was smart. Alright. Oh, nice, 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 nice. That is great. That is really good. Didn't need to consecrate that little guy. Yeah, yeah, you gotta be kidding me! Oh crap, that's not good. I can kill it next turn. Oh, no, I can't. <laughs> I need something good here. Yeah, 
let's see. Another card draw for him. That's okay. Where do I have to take this guy out? Not that. <laughs> hmm. Give me a quest. Save the consecration. And you gotta hit this. Unless he's got a silence, which he probably does not. He's eyeing the top deck card. Come on, quit going through. Look at him. He's just going with I hear you got a problem. Oh, 10 cost Raven Old Assassin. Alright. Works for me. Still got the taunt up. Perfect. Uh, oh, yeah, let's do that. Red alert. And then. Guy. Hit and. Bam. And let's do six damage. Or, or five damage. Quest accepted. Alright, we have lethal. We have lethal. We still have lethal. We still have lethal. Come on. Cause he's gonna he could ping and then kill that. Oh man. He's got two cards left. We still have lethal. Come on. No frostbolt. No frostbolt. No frostbolt. Yes. 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 We did it. Oh man, I cannot believe we pulled that one out. Quest accepted. Wow. We are down big time. All right. Five no. I can't believe this. <laughs> All right, let's go for six. Let's go for six. Uther, going against the priest. Undoing. I hate priests. The I hate playing against priests so much. All right, uh, should honor. we keep that? No, we don't have the coin. Let's toss these two. Not any better. Wish I would have had the Yeti, actually, <laughs> instead of that. That is also not good until the end. Dang it. Okay. We're good, we're good. Is someone injured? Mm -hmm. Crap. Um We're not going to play anything. Because if I played that, she could hit, pop the shield and take one damage, be healed and then draw a card. Uh if I played this, same deal, Mind except you kill it. Need? Now I have a reason to play the Anointron. Because now I can kill this guy. But uh, yeah, I just saved one card draw. By I, I made him not draw a card by taking one damage. That was basically the whole series of events there. But he got the card anyways with that. <laughs> so it doesn't really matter. Oh, nice. Well played. Uh, let's see. Okay, good. I was going to say, I don't really want to play this because that dies, but this is even better. Ooh, wait. That becomes a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. That's a 4, 6. Yeah, that's better than the Eddie by 1. So yeah, I think I'll play it. Yeah. Better play those as early as possible because chances are you'll have more cards in the beginning than in the end. God, look how many cards he has. Holy crap. Hmm, his own Yeti. Okay. Well, this thing is basically anti Yeti, so I'll probably play that. Yep, we'll play that. Anti Yeti. And we'll kill this guy, because that is really bothering me. No more cards for this guy. Let us see it. 
Ah, well played. That was impressive. Oh, consecration would be fantastic right about now. Oh no, it wouldn't. <laughs> oh wow. Okay. Ah, uh, he keeps going face. Alright, I think Sunwalker looks good here. Sunwalker and then kill the 3-3. Three, three. Earthen Ring Walker? Earthen Ring. Farseer, not Walker. Um, Sunwalker, that's what I got that from. <laughs> uh, or we could play Yeti Shielded Minibot, but I think this is better because uh, nobody has 5, five attack. Yet. You never know with Priests. Next turn, maybe mini bot and heal bot, or maybe Yeti and mini bot. I don't want to play this yet. I wonder. Not until he's got a big scary guy on the board. See, nobody sees this coming. This is a big surprise because it's a crappy card, um, and it's so crappy that no, oh, that nobody expects it. That was very well. Played. I am in trouble here. This Yeti will keep getting healed and healed and healed and healed. Yep, there he goes. Oh boy. Okay, let's this, this, and this. And so next turn we can play that and get a bunch of cards. Play that and that. Yeah, that'll be good. We'll get like five or six cards. Depending on how many he plays this turn. He'll probably spend two of his mana healing that. Ah, yes. Good, he only got rid of one card. And four damage. Not that good. But it'll get me another card draw here. Okay. Um, hmm. I'll probably keep the golem alive. No, what am I talking about? Yeah, I think I will. Do I want to play this or this is the question. I, wonder. I think I'm going to play this and get rid of the stinking Yeti. And that way I can get rid of the, uh, the spare part of it. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, we'll give it to the Minibot? No, who do I give it to? I guess it doesn't really matter. Um, we'll give it to the Minibot because of Holy Nova, I guess. And then we play this and draw five cards. One, two, three, four, five. Nice. Weapon and then there's no point hitting that because he'll just heal it back up. So there we go. Probably take six damage, which is very scary because I only have 16, but I do have uh, six heals right there. I also have a big taunt. And eight right there. Yeah, what am I talking about? I'm good. Oh, no. Go for it? Yes. Okay, good. But I didn't go for face. Oh, okay. He's still not going for face. Oh, wow. That's that's hilarious. Um, okay. That that was well, well played. That avoids the consecrate. That makes me very sad. Um, wow. Let's see. Probably consecrate <laughs> Razor Fen Hunter. And then I have two more. I'll probably. Minibot. Yeah. Consecrate and then kill this. Don't mess with Tusker. <laughs> Just to play it safe. Uh, next turn we have. Um, these three for only four mana, which is nice. Oh yeah, we can play all four of these guys next turn. Or this for four, which is pretty nice. That's okay. That, what? Why do you have that? Come on. Oh wow. Watch this. This is why I put so many mechs in this deck. Triple. Oh man, that feels so good to do. 
That was just fantastic. <laughs> and we will hit that once. Just for fun. Let's see what you got, priest. Let's see what you got. That was a big turn. I didn't want to play Lord of the Arena because of the Cobra. And so this is perfect. Okay. Thank you. Fantastic. Oh my god. You have got to be kidding me. You've got to be kidding me. I have six damage on the board. Give me some... Yes! Yes! Whew, that was a close one. Wow. I just got really, really lucky. For justice. Weapon ready. That's like the only. Is that like Weapon the only direct ready. damage that I have? I Holy crap! I just got super lucky. <laughs> oh man. Whew. Shadow of death. No. <laughs> Here comes 12 damage. Oh, wow. Okay. That doesn't do much. Doesn't do much good. Oh, wow. Okay. Um. Hmm. We could kill the ogre. But I, I don't think I'm going to. I think I'm going to Kodo. Yeah. Kill this guy, please. No. That was a mistake. Okay, that's fine though. We do the fair reporting. But loads of damage Weapon now. Ready. Weapon ready. Weapon ready. And yeah, there's no point killing that. And I think we end it. Yes. Save that. He's in deep shit right now. <laughs> he is in trouble. Should have killed that. <laughs> Whoops. That's okay. Um, that's okay. For the crusade. Okay. Ready. For justice. We still get it down. To six, which he probably heals from. Oh no, we have to kill these. Weapon yeah. ready. Kill that. Okay, we're still good. We're still good. We're still good. That was his big 10 drop. He can't have two. I mean, what would he steal? What would he steal that? Big deal. In the light's name. Oh, okay. Thanks. Thank <laughs> okay, so we do three, five, seven, eight. Well. He's healing everybody. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Woo, six and zero, oh, baby. It's a new record. Yes. Okay. And I have zero losses. This is awesome. Uh, that'll probably have to be it for this episode. Look at that. Uh, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you in the next time when we continue the streak.